hi everyone ravi this side welcome to engineering adda so today i'm going to discuss what is jenkins why we are going to use jenkins and how we are using jenkins so let me go to the next slide and show you what is jenkins so jenkins is a tool that is used for automation so jenkins is a ci cd pipeline tool so what do you mean by ci cd so ci means continuous integration which means when you are going to commit some changes to the git it automatically after that does the build and then does the test and then deploy it so this is what ci cd continuous integration like whatever changes you are going to push to the git the same thing will start building and testing and deploying so continuously everything is followed up after the push so that is why it is called continuous integration and continuous deployment deployment so jenkins is an open source server that allows all the developers to build test and deploy softwares it works on java as it is written in java so when you are going to install jenkins it will ask for the java okay so by using jenkins we can make a continuous integration of project so we can design each steps of our pipeline using jenkins so let me go to the next slide and then show you what is before jenkins scenario okay so what was the scenario before jenkins so let me try to introduce one scenario let's say you are working in a us or uk based client okay and you are working in india and you are working for the us or uk based project so their timing and your timing is different okay so you are working in let's say uh, in afternoon from 12 to 8 and they are working in the different time and their build is happening around 5 am ist and you are sleeping at the time so what is happening let's say today you did some changes you commit your codes and then you log off and the build is happening 5 am in the morning then let's say because of some error the build has broken and nobody knows whose commit is making the build broke so then the finger pointing would begin in the team so this was the scenario before jenkins but jenkins solves this scenario that is why we are using jenkins how it is solving because of ci cd pipeline okay so let me discuss one another scenario let's say you are working in a project and their build time is around 10 or 12 pm in night okay so what is happening you have to push your changes before their timing let's say you push your changes to the afternoon 12 and their build is 11 pm in the night so with the time gap you are just keeping and wasting your time so that was another scenario so this was the scenario before jenkins but after jenkins because of the ci cd pipeline uh, nothing like this happens so whenever the build is broken you can track it out and the developer will get the notification immediately and it can start working on the errors so let me go to the next slide so what is jenkins used for so jenkins is used to build and test your product continuously so each time someone is committing the changes it will start the build it will start the test and then start the deployment so if anything is failing then uh, immediately the developer will get notified and then the developer is start working on the errors so developer can continuously integrate changes into the build jenkins is most popular open source ci cd tool on the market today and is is used in support of devops alongside other cloud native tools let me go to the next slide this is how the jenkins pipeline is looking like so let's say you are a developer you commit your code and then you push your code to the git 
and you made one pipeline Jenkins pipeline then once you commit your changes to the git it will start doing the build it will start taking care of the test and it will start the deployment either in the dev QA or any UAT environment once everything is fine then you can deploy your changes to the production let's say some build is failed then it will immediately notify the developers and the developers can look into that and then again commit the changes to the git so again the build will start so this is how Jenkins pipeline look like let me go to the next slide so this is how it works how the Jenkins is working so earlier when the Jenkins was not there it was really difficult for the team to know who broke the build but after Jenkins because we are using the CI CD pipeline then it will immediately notify whose commit is breaking the build so we are able to know so the finger pointing is not there in the team and now the developer can immediately pick up the error and then start debugging the code and then once the code is fixed it can push the code to the git again and the build will start so now it is easy to determine okay I will try to show you how uh, this thing happens I will try to create some Spring Boot project I will try to show you how you can manage your build how you can start doing the double deployment so everything I will show you practically in the next coming videos Jenkins provides the ability to run a build in a parallel across multiple machines to minimize the total amount of time it takes to complete many of these activity so parallel execution is also possible in the Jenkins so this is about Jenkins introduction in the next video I will try to cover how we can install Jenkins on our Windows machine and then coming videos I will try to create some application and try to show you how you can plan your build how you can create a pipeline and how you can deploy something on the Jenkins so this is about this video guys if you like the video please hit the like button and please subscribe the channel for more such content